two of the passengers on this private jet bound for Lancashire at the weekend share a passionate interest in Blackburn Rovers. Jack Walker, one of Jersey's wealthiest residents, has injected millions, transforming the Blackburn club into title contenders. But these days he has a regular passenger, Pierre Lesson, whose son Graham plays fullback, 17 years after he was first watched as an amateur by Jack Walker. Well, um, I've, I've seen every game he's played this season and you, you've seen him improve every game, you know. Oh, the board and myself have just said, well, he has to be playing for England. He, he's improved on every match he's played. The 25-year-old could now become the first Channel Islander to play for England, a reward for his adventurous adaption of the fullback role. He arrived at Ewood Park 12 months ago and compared to the rest of his teammates, cost Rovers small change. Obviously, there's a long way to go before I know I'm playing or, you know, if I'm on the bench or, you know, just, just going along for the trip. But, I'm, you know, I'm looking forward to the experience and, uh, you know, it's very exciting. I think it's a lot of it's the environment you're working in. I'm working in a, in a good environment with good professionals around me and getting coached well. Since being signed from Chelsea by Rovers manager Kenny Dalglish, Lesor has been a consistent performer in what he could now establish as his national as well as club position alongside colleagues like David Batty. Lesor Senior says his son simply enjoys his work. One of the most important things about Graham is he smiles a lot when he's playing. That's because he enjoys the game and um, I think as long as you enjoy the game you'll keep playing for as long as possible. This was the ground in St Helier where Lesor's potential was first spotted. Staff there will be delighted if their boy walks out at Wembley. They have someone like Graham who's level-headed, can be an ambassador for football. It will raise the, um, the profile of football in Jersey tremendously. We're all very excited about it. That satisfaction is shared by everyone at Ewood Park, from the high-profile owner and his manager to the youngest fans.